I'm pumped. I'm excited. It's going to be great. Today couldn't have went better for Joey and I. But heading into tonight, I'm feeling pretty anxious. I love my family so much. They mean so much to me. And you never really are sure going into any situation like this what reservations they have to it all. Sit. Yep. Is just, you know, very important to me to get validation from them. <laughs> Birdie. Going into tonight, I'm very nervous. I know how important her family is. I know how special of a person her dad is. All right. Hey, Joey, how you doing? Nice Mark, nice to meet you. So if tonight doesn't go well, I know she'll be crushed. I want to have a future with Kelsey and have no doubt that what we have is worthwhile and strong and real. So like. I heard from you for like I, know. I think we need to update them on what we've been yeah, up to, yeah, maybe yeah. a little bit more so info. I'm not kidnapped. Good. <laughs> Let's get that out. <laughs> um, so we got to go to Spain. Oh, wow. And that's where we had our first one on one. Mm -hmm. And then after that, we went to Canada. Mm -hmm. And that was my first like group date back after a one on one. And it was like pretty hectic just being like, oh, there's other girls in my life. I haven't seen Kelsey for six weeks. And it's been very hard not to see her, not to communicate with her. This is a scary process. And with something like this, I think it's very difficult not to have her mother here. She was a very protective mother, and there would never be a shortage of questions with her here. Is this your first time to, to Louisiana? This is the second time I've been here. But it was special today because we got to kind of do it in our own way. Throughout, like, today, every time I would talk about mom, uh, I kept seeing butterflies flying around. And I was like, she's here. And I was like, yeah. and she's trying to get on camera, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not missing this moment. <laughs> well, guess what? What? <gasps> There's mom! Yeah, we have like a ton of pictures. That's my mom. My oh, mom looks so cute. She's beautiful. <laughs> oh my gosh, mom looks so pretty. I can't tell you how much I've wanted to see a picture of her. <laughs> this Stunning. is so special. Dad, you look so cute! <laughs> Young stud. I don't know if I've even seen half these pictures. It's right? so fun. Taylor would play tug of war with our dolls. Is that her mouth right now? Yeah. That's her mouth. You put it Taylor in her mouth. <laughs> Kelsey is the one who takes the most after mom, for sure. She's just like, hey, I'm me, and like, I'm going to be the sunshine person just like mama was. A little, a little snapshot, right? This is so special. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I love you. Oh, I love you. Hey, Birdie, want to have a little chit chat? Yeah, okay. let's do it. <laughs> Kelsey deserves the best of the best. Somebody as special to them as my parents had with each other. And I'm afraid for her if she gets her heart broken. Like, I, I just want her to be happy. Yeah. It's so weird, like, you know, not being able to call and like vent or yeah. just you know, like reassurance. Like, I kept pinching myself today, just being like, oh my gosh, like, oh, he's in New Orleans. Like, oh, he wants to meet my family. I want him to meet my family. Yeah. Like all these crazy emotions. And like, I've been like kind of like holding back a little bit because I want to see the dynamic with like family and everything. And so far it's been like, I don't know y'all see, I don't know. Yeah. It just seems like it's well, gonna go well. <laughs> I think that we all know like, if you're bringing a guy to us, like, he's going to be a great guy. But have there been any, like, complications or, like, I don't know, something to, like, no. argument, that to, like, work through together? Or Not anything? really. I think the only thing, like, I don't really know where he's at with the other girls. I know where we're at. And, you know, maybe he's further along with other girls. And so I think that that's what I'm, like, kind of scared about. Yeah. I'm also afraid for, like, you know, if you get to this point and, like, the moment happens that you do get sent home. Like, I don't want you to have your little heart broken. Yeah, I think I love that. I, th I appreciate that. Um, but I think that I've really tried to, like, give this whole Also, at the end of the day, if it's not me, like, at least, like, I know yeah. I really tried and I put myself out there. I do feel really protective over you, and I want you to have nothing but the happiest of times, like, forever. <laughs> no bad times, only happy times. That's it. That's all. <laughs> I love you, too. Joey, can we have a quick talk? Kelsey's got a heart of gold. A nice little setup. Tonight, I'm looking to see if Joey cares for Kelsey like I care for Kelsey. Is he a protector? Is he someone that would, you know, keep her happy? I want to talk to Kelsey before she left to do The Bachelor. Mm -hmm. I wasn't sure about it, mm -hmm. right? Um, my biggest fear was that 
as she's developing feelings for you, it would have been a difficult thing to see you going on a date with someone else. Yeah. For me, it's, it's a weird feeling when there are multiple people and I'm always trying to pay attention and check in. And I can tell you, you would be so proud of her, how she's been through this. So I just feel special and, and lucky to have gotten to meet her. And I know that it wouldn't have happened unless I've done something like this, which is why I'm so grateful. Yeah. When I met Kelsey's mom, it was like I knew it right away. Mm -hmm. In a normal dating situation, ideally you would date one person mm -hmm. at a time. How do you know when you actually find the right one? Yeah. It's difficult for me. I have a lot of days where I've struggled because there are feelings that are truthfully real and you find yourself holding back from time to time because I want every word I speak, every moment, everything I say to have a lot of intention. But the reason I'm holding back is because I am trying to be aware of her heart. And all I can tell you is that my feelings for her are real and they do make sense. And I'm extremely hopeful, I really am. Well, that's very kind of, you know, helps my heart. So after talking with Joey, I felt, uh, I felt reassured. But as a father, I'm, a, of course, concerned with Kelsey. I think the man deserving of Kelsey is one that she picks. So I'm looking forward to talking with her. How are you doing? I'm good. Yeah? Oh well, I mean, but with, like, everything. I think that I've definitely had, like, my ups and downs of, like, throughout this whole process. But then I had my one-on-one -on -one in Spain, and we were strolling around Spain, and it was like, just felt like me and my boyfriend were exploring the city. Oh, nice. Um, and I told him about mom and how you took care of mom through like, you know, like how sick she got and everything that you did for her. You were like such a good husband to her. And like, I feel like that's what I really look for is like, you know, someone that would be there through like the hard times and like, you know, the good times. And then like knowing that, <sighs> knowing that after like you saw like the love of your life like pass away and knowing that you had to take care of all of us and like be there for all of us like I can't imagine <sighs> you know I want somebody like that for me and mom and you always like told us like that's what we deserve and not to settle for someone that you know doesn't give us you know everything that we deserve I feel like Joey really does that and I could see that him doing like those things for sure to see the way that he is towards you, right? Mm -hmm. Like, it's very reassuring. Um, I want all of you to feel that, um, that feeling I had with your mom. Um, because it's like the best thing in the world. It's crazy. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> but like, I don't know, already I was just like, I just, I think I love him. <laughs> um, but no, he's great. I love you. <laughs> I love you. There's always a possibility of heartbreak. You just never know when it's gonna come. I think Kelsey's ready for the happiness. Kelsey's ready for enjoying life. Um, and with that, she has to be ready to you know, suffer through heartbreak if that's what happens. Thank you. I feel very, very happy. and It was wonderful to see Kelsey, to see Joey and the connection that they have. I understand there's still the other women, um, but I think Joey will take care of Kelsey. And I do hope she, I do hope she's engaged when she comes home. That was special. They were so loving, they were so open and honest, and I'm really, really happy. Yeah, I agree. I am so sure about who you are, but like knowing that other people see that and like see our connection, especially my family, and like, you know, they mean so much to me. So for them to just kind of validate my feelings, I think that like that's everything I needed and more. But yeah. I think, like, things just feel so right with you. It's a great day. It was a great day. I just really am happy with how today went, and especially how tonight. I would count myself lucky to be a part of this family. I really, really feel good where Kelsey and I are at. And I know that we left today stronger than we were going into it. Oh, my God. I don't want to say bye.
I am feeling fantastic. That reassurance from my family was very pivotal for me. Having my mom there would have been amazing, but throughout this whole date, I felt my mom's presence. See you soon. All right. She wouldn't miss this for the world and like think that she would have loved Joey. Especially after just him meeting my family, like I just want to blurt that I love him. I'm ready for whatever may come and I'm ready to fight for him and I hope that he feels the same way.